first bit of advice is not to be intimidated by change. Because although it's a different symbology, the basics, the ethos of what everything GS1 stands for remains in place. It's just a different tool to communicate the same information in a lot of cases, not in all, but in a lot of cases we've been capturing for a very long time. So what that means is that we're taking what we see in a real world, in a physical sense, to an online world. That opens up opportunities. So if we're capturing all of that data in an online world, then we can start to do some amazing things. Don't be intimidated by it. It's just a new version of what we've been working with for a long time. Maybe not as early as you think, and that's not to say that, that existing partners are not vitally important to this, because they are. But what's evolved in the, in the world of interoperability is the ease of systems to talk to one another now is so much easier than what it's been before. So as long as data is getting captured by a system, the mechanism for sharing that data to form a traceability journey is not as, more, is not as complicated as what brand owners might think. So it's about mapping out what a project looks like to start with, then engaging the providers. A brand owner needs to understand what the starting point is and then go from there. The opportunities are endless. It's such an exciting space. By going from a world of traditional print to a world of online opens up so much opportunity and that's the basis. I can't put one single, one single item on it. The ability to go online means that the consumer engagement, the logistic and supply chain engagement, the knowledge that a brand owner will get about their products are endless. And that opens up so many use cases as well. What GS1 have done is put a plan going forward that actually enables industry adoption to, to go forward. Whether it be Result or any of our peers in the industry, we've done a lot of work in actually understanding how to use the technology so that we can support the marketplace. And I think that's something that we all as an industry should be very, very proud of.